This is where we're going to go through some homework assignments. We're going to go over the board, and then we're going to wrap it up. I bet you didn't know you're going to learn a lot about coupons mm -hmm. today. We're going to take 10 for 10. We're going to throw a coupon on it. You're going to get an even better deal. Here's an example. Hot dogs. Major grocery chain last week had a sale. These hot dogs were 58 cents. On a two pack, you save a dollar. That was 16 cents for a pack of hot dogs. Regular price, $1.99. Do your kids use toothbrushes? Yeah. Okay. Here's a toothbrush on sale. How much? 99 cents. How much is that coupon? A dollar. How much is that now? Free. Free. They owe you money. And in fact, you're right. At this major store, it's called a money maker. You would actually walk out with a six cent credit. So wow. when, when milk's a dollar and you have a two dollar off coupon, they give you a dollar credit towards anything else you want to buy. You guys need to embrace coupons. Have so to for example, to laundry detergent at a major store last week, five ninety nine. It was on sale for two ninety nine, and there was a two dollar off coupon. It was ninety nine cents for laundry detergent. How expensive is that stuff? Oh, I know. We go through it like water. It's unbelievable. And you can buy six of those. So you're gonna have to get a few newspapers maybe three or four or five, but we've allocated that. School lunches, this is tough, but the, I mean, 40 cents a meal, I get it. I'm with you, but when I look at $210 a month, that's 15% of your deficit. Right. And you're, you know a lot about nutrition. I know you do. I mean, you can, you can feed people nutritiously good, probably better than that school food, I guarantee you. I'm telling you, with those budget cuts at the school, they're feeding them garbage. Right. You know what right. I'm saying? And you can pay attention. There's good, high-quality stuff that you can get and feed your kids. It's a lot better. It's better for the family. And think about when they're young adults or adults and what they're teaching your grandkids. Right. Goodwill, thrift stores, yeah. last chance. Do you know last chance? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. Quality shoes for nothing. You've got to start thinking that way. Shoes, too. You can get shoes for that are not worn out. or Yes brand new at last chance and make a game out of it june you get new shoes july you get new shoes whatever it is you know, allocate a kid it's each each month the kid has a, a, a you know it's their month maybe if it's their birthday month whatever it is right. but integrate that you'll still find joy out of this stuff there's a lot of ways to find joy